Gotta do the mouse thing again. Alright then. Let's see what we can do this time around. Come on. I think... Mm. Do I have to go somewhere else first? Aha. I'm guessing I'm gonna have to sacrifice these poor things again to gnaw on some kind of... Uh, cables or such to open the way. Or maybe not. Just the way forward. You won't hear me complain. Hmm. Looks like we'll just have to jump down. Gotta break everything. After the last two games where I couldn't break anything, now I can break everything and I will break everything. This feels more like a Castlevania game <laughs> in this regard. You can break everything apart, even candles. All right, let's check the memorial. Memorial to Andra de Weigol. Tribute memorial to Andra de Weigol, soldier of the Brotherhood of Light. The descendants of the Weigols, deeply rooted in the city, wish to express and share with their neighbors and visitors their eternal admiration and gratitude to the brave Andra. This corner of the city will always be a place of meditation and seclusion. A place to celebrate that the Prince of Darkness was defeated forever by all those who fought and died so that we might live in peace today. Andra was one of them. His descendants could not be more proud of his bravery and sacrifice. Rest in peace. With his own memorial tucked in a little corner over here, ripe for the rape and um, crime. That would uh, definitely be... A part of this part of the town. I'm sure Andrade Weigol would be very proud of his legacy. Hello there. There we go. Another memorial. You would think that the memorials are something that would be visible to everyone, not tucked away in hidden corners where nobody can see them. The first founders, from the Architects Guild to the Fathers of the City, following the siege of Dracula's castle and his subsequent defeat, the site remained in ruins for at least two centuries. It took generations for the first colonists to dare set foot in a land considered to be cursed. In an act of bravery and reclaiming their memory, they, those colonists decided to establish themselves on the foundations of the destroyed castle, founding the colony that is our city today. As terrible as the events that occurred during the reign of Dracula were, the very existence of this city is proof of the strength, determination and invisibility of the human spirit. Here. Is there something I'm missing again? No, 
I don't think so. Aha! <laughs> well, look at that. Hmm? Patient disinfection area. Right, it looks like we found our target place. So, now I have to find our way through this kind of hospital place. Oh shit! Look at that, Doctor Gabriel. We have to uh, check on a few patients first. Hello, you. What do you have for me? The origins of the mental hospital. This memorial was created for the construction of the city's mental hospital in 1902. During the foundation works for the building, a mass grave was discovered with thousands of skeletal remains of newborns. Until then, no one believed certain legends about the concubines of Dracula who, transformed into snakes, entered the houses of the towns around the castle and took away the babies. Now we know those horrible legends were true. Let this memorial be a tribute to all those who lived, suffered and died during those times of atrocity and despair. And I'm sure the patients of the mental hospital would uh, definitely read this memorial plaque. Jesus Christ, sometimes. Who made these things? Hmm. I need to get through this door, but how? How? How indeed? I gotta do something in here, I guess. But what? Aha! Uh -huh. I can see you down there. There we go. Let's clear the place of the junk. Yes, that's better. Hmm. Pictures of saints. See that over there. All right. Time to hide in the dark. Let's see what lies on the other side. A pain box. But how do I get up from here to use it? Hmm. Hmm. What? Ah, across to this side. I got confused for a moment there. Hmm. The rats can pass through. All right. Almost here. Just want. Just need to find a place to recover my. Ah, there we go. True form. Very nice. Guys, the doctor is in the house. Well, that's not very nice now, is it? I 
There we go. That wasn't so hard now, was it? Let's top up our magic. And we're ready to descend even deeper. Until the next checkpoint. Anything behind me? Doesn't look like it. Looks like the uh, castle's blood can seep even here into the real world. That, that won't stop me. So now, here we have uh, all these delicious pipes that need to be frosted over for us to pass through and get to the paint box. Get our hands on a void stone and move on. Gotta pump it, it seems. Alright then. Huh. Huh. What? Ah, oh, come on, sometimes. <sighs> Sounds like these that you realize why Batman Arkham's the Arkham games had uh, detective vision. All right, I think this is uh, time for us to say goodbye for now, fellas. Thank you very much for watching. Do like and subscribe if you enjoyed this. And I'll see you next time in Gabriel's Adventures in Lords of Shadow 2. Till then. Take care.